Hey guys, Brian, SoCal Sumoto. We're here with Crino, and uh, we're gonna do some shit. Uh, and uh, basically, just want to take a look at the good old-fashioned knee down versus foot out. You'll hear people say fastest riders in the world go foot out, therefore foot out is the fastest. There's a major flaw in that argument, and that is you are not the fastest rider in the world. I'm not the fastest rider. We know that whatever you feel the most comfortable doing from doing this over years and years yeah. is probably going to be the uh, fastest way to also, go. Also, fastest lap time here by Joe Roberts went knee down. Yeah, so. what does he know? Amateur. <laughs> <laughs> so we're not about to go tell Joe Roberts he's doing it wrong when he has the lap record. Uh, but we thought we'd see it because uh, Crino's, what do you like better? DRZ, I'll go foot out uh, just because I'm used to it. So I think I'll be a little faster foot out because I'm more comfortable. But besides that, all right, let's hear the prediction. 0.3 second faster foot out. 0.3 faster foot out. I don't know. All right, yeah. we don't know. We're going to get the lap times. We're yeah. going to get some footy, check it out, and then uh, we'll talk after. All right, let's do it. felt terrible. terrible. I haven't ridden knee down on a supermoto I think in over a year. Um, I think I went way faster foot out actually. It way, felt faster. Way faster. The prediction was you're gonna be faster foot out and you felt horrible knee down. And but that's just me. Yeah. The uh, first reveal you were the same. Really? Same lap times knee what? down versus foot out. There is an exception to that. Overall, on average, you were slightly faster knee down, but at the very end, you put a second lap, one second faster foot out. So if we were looking collectively, you were faster knee down. If we're looking at a per lap, you had one lap that you were almost a second faster going foot out. So I am shocked. So this is the race advice. Qualifying, I'm gonna go foot out. <laughs> During the race, I'm gonna go knee down. Yeah. So that was one prediction. The other prediction you said is that you were going to be off camera before. You said you were going to be slower at the end of the session because of issues with brake fade. No, I actually felt more comfortable on the bike. Yeah, I warmed you, you up. Got, <laughs> you warmed up, yeah. Yeah, I warmed you up. Definitely, your, uh, your lap times were uh, two to three seconds slower per lap, what, your first two or three. Yeah. And then you warmed got warmed up, up and then you're ready to go. Nice. And then uh, you said that Christine is not the fastest bike. However, I run two and a half seconds faster on Christine than you do on this bike, which is weird because I'll be the first to tell you that Crino's faster than me. So basically everything that Crino thinks is true about being is fast wrong. is it's wrong. It's completely wrong. He, that bike's faster <laughs> because I'm faster than him even though he's a faster rider than me on that bike. That's weird because I always passed you on the track. I know. That was the next thing I was going to say is I think in order, and you always get me on the brakes, yeah. right? So I think you're passing me because uh, we always talk about there's a difference between going fast and racecraft, right? So uh, he'll stuff me on the brakes. I'm horrible on the brakes. He'll get me on the brakes. And uh, so what did we learn today? Uh, everything Carino thinks is wrong. And for all practical purposes, he is the same foot out versus knee down, even though he hates knee down and, you know, likes foot out. I just like knee down on the minis. Yeah. Just ride minis. But most importantly, what did we learn? What do you like to do? Foot out. Foot out. So we're gonna ride foot out. And I bet if we had did it with the uh, with the dirt section open, that when you run the dirt, it affects your lap times on the yeah. rest of the thing too. So if you're running the dirt, I bet it wouldn't be close. I bet because you stay consistent yeah. with that foot out style. I bet you'd be it would be a big difference uh, running the dirt versus running the dirt foot out and then knee down on the asphalt. A lot of times people uh, side kind of fun note where I make this point about how it's not a big of a deal as people make it out to be. Uh, one day I came out and I tore my thigh muscle doing something stupid. And I set my lap record going knee down on the lefts and foot out on the rights. And uh, it could mean that I'm just a big fat kook, or it could mean my theory, which is 
however you feel comfortable is probably the fastest and beyond all that whatever you have the most fun doing do that but in the case of Crino he's basically the same maybe I, even faster knee down hates knee down did pull one lap faster I, down. I think what we can take away from this is that we offer no real good motorcycle advice but a about? lot of great information I just brought like, it's like I real brought world information wisdom. like real world information that's like all right how can I apply that <laughs> Just yeah. go ride. Yeah. <laughs> Just go ride. Shut up, ride. Have a good time. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. Sweet. That's it. Nice job. Thank you.